A tricky stack okay, okay. in any relationship is deciding when to finally let your boo have a key to your place. Oh, my God. Mm -hmm. What? Yeah, so how would you feel if you finally gained the courage to ask for entry mm -hmm. but got denied? Oh. Hurt. Well, really hurt. Yeah. Well, according to Madame Noir, not getting a key from your boo isn't necessarily gloom and doom for a relationship. The writer explains that it's just a key and you only really need to be concerned if he won't let you in to see his place at all. Now, what? that's according of to course. this writer. That's she. Now, ladies, I put yeah. the, I pose the question to the table. Do you think that a key is a successful relationship <laughs> thing? Okay, is that... Ugh. What? I'm, I'm sorry. I, I have to completely <laughs> disagree with Madame Noir on this one. I think it actually says something a lot deeper than just a key, and I think that's what a man would like you to believe is it's just a key. I think it also depends on how long you've been together, okay, and do they have a key to your apartment? Yeah. And I'm yeah. only saying this from life experience. Okay. Um, every apartment I had in New York City, my boyfriend at the time had a key, but I did not have a key to his home. I then let go of my apartment because I came to do the show here, uh -huh. yeah. so when I was in New York, I would stay with him but I was never given a key. On purpose? Were you, were you, how long denied? was the relationship At that you point, got the key? four years. And were you denied? Like, oh, did you ask so, for it? I'm not gonna lie, I was never given the key, but then at some point, I had a sit-down conversation where I'm not gonna lie, I cried because I was just like, you had the keys to all of my apartments and now yeah. I'm kind of staying with you, but I'm not made to feel... And what did he say? Welcome. He was like, that's crazy. Oh my God, Adrian, it's just a key. Exactly, uh, what exactly what this Madame Noir person is Damn. saying. Did he ever but give you the key the, then? Yeah, but after I asked for it. And it that is never... why Adrian is no longer with that person. No, but... <laughs> <laughs> but I, I have to say, you are only treated the way you allow someone to Let treat you. So yeah, it's actually yeah, my fault. Wait, but That's I have right. a question. It's my fault. I have a question. Did you, when in the relationship did you give him the key? Like, uh, how long maybe did two you years did... in. Okay, so yeah. two years in. Uh, eh, maybe it was a year in. Okay. okay. And I'm going to tell you why. Uh, it was more of a convenience thing. Yes. Uh, that we'd go to events and we'd do quick changes at the house. And I had, like, a house in the city. It was easy to locate. So I'm like, you know how I am. I'd give yeah. any of you guys. I'd be like, oh, my God, yeah. You want to come? that type of person. Yeah, and yeah. I feel like if we're trying to build on something... I think that's a part of building. That's a part of what's mine is yours and what's yours is mine. Like, yeah. right. I never felt like I had anything to hide. Right. That's just but the once person you got, I am. Okay, once you got the key, was there any difference? But what or... it took for me to ask for the key was really hurtful. Yeah, And I think that's what a lot of people don't realize is by the time I was asking for the key, it was because it was embarrassing. Like, now I was at an embarrassing place where I had to be like, so I've been living, like, and I would love to have a key, like, my question was, why didn't you offer it to me? Why do I always have to ask? Right, right. For because things? after a while, How then you feel awful. How many times did you ask? No, it's why did I always? If I'm honest, I always felt like I was pushing for every step. Oh. Do you know what I mean? When you're like constantly like, why should I have to ask for? Whereas like, my relationship that I'm in now, my husband would have been like, oh my god, I, this, yes. is this something? Well, I, I can't imagine explain. any relationship where you would have to feel awkward about being. Open. Yeah, especially if it's in a relationship. Yes. That's like, the whole thing. You know? And I think I... those are red flags that back then I thought it's me. Yeah, but then right. sometimes it's the person because me, I don't like giving keys to nobody. Okay? I don't, you know what I mean? Yeah. I just, I'm like, but you got your place. Towards, like you want to marry the person, you want to be with them. You're not working towards that Yeah, but that I mean, either. but to me, that's not a key. That's a ring, baby. Okay? I don't, I don't care about no key. If yeah. you're trying to get married, then you're trying to get a ring. But yes. I think for me, because yeah. there's certain people, they just they just like their own place. And it's not necessarily because it was you. Maybe he's a very private person. Maybe he's very controlling. I living I'm like, I'm saying that because I'm like that. Yeah, you know what yeah, I mean? Yeah. And every time I meet a dude, they want, they want a key. You ain't getting no key, sweet. You weren't true. No, boo. True.